My name is Dario, not Dario. <laughs> Someone called me Dario, but I like Dario. Um, <laughs> what was the question? <laughs> what do you do for work in Japan? <laughs> okay, I'm working as a tourist guide. I don't have a license, but in Japan from maybe a couple of years ago, uh, since the uh, request for like kind of tourist guides getting higher and higher and there's few licensed guys the government decided to allow also not the licensed guy to do the same job so this is what I'm doing for mainly Italian people coming to Japan and I bring them all around Japan I mean the mainly place like uh, main important place like Tokyo, Kyoto, Osaka, Nara. but uh, also I do in English sometimes but only for in Hiroshima because I know quite well this area. That's good. Oh, okay. I didn't know you travel so much. <laughs> oh, I traveled. Yeah, I traveled. <laughs> traveled. Uh, so the tour guide business must be difficult during this COVID nineteen situation. How hard has that been for you recently? It's been it's been really hard because after February, yes, I had my last tour in February. Nobody was able to come in Japan because the Japanese government closed everything. And uh, so I'm not working as a tourist guide from February. I'm trying to find some other part-time job. For example, like I try to apply as a waiter in a pizzeria in Shina Inokuchi, but uh, they say because of Corona, no customers. So no customer, no need for waiters so what I'm doing now is uh, teaching try to teach English or Italian to some Japanese uh, I did some webinar for always Italian customer uh, who were interested about Japan so I like we made like online tour of Hiroshima and Nijima so they were kind of interested about and what I'm trying to do now is uh, pushing my channels my uh, social media uh, also mainly for Hiroshima because I think it's uh, uh, underestimated uh, is it correct? Yeah. Yeah. city so but I think there's a lot of a lot to see here yeah, around Hiroshima for yeah, example undervalued under, sorry. Okay, so <laughs> Hiroshima is so undervalued mm -hmm. city and I would like to let people come to Hiroshima at least one day, but more than one day because we have a lot of things to visit here around Hiroshima, like Kure, uh, also Kintaikyo, we have uh, uh, Saijo, we have uh, Mafukuyama, we have a lot of places, Sandankyo. So I'm trying to push Hiroshima Prefecture as much as possible. What would you say are the most popular things that your Italian clients have enjoyed in Japan? For sure, one of the reasons why Italian come to Japan is to eat the real sushi. Because in Italy, we have a lot of sushi restaurants, but the owners are Chinese. So, well, it's different. And also the quality of the food and the rice, which I think is like chemistry. So the rice must be good, but the fish must be good as well to have a perfect combo. So, and also the, I have to say, the, not the quality, but also the, we have less different kind of sushi type, just like some tuna or salmon, maybe eel, but not like many fish that are available here in Japan. So they want to try as much as possible here. So this is one reason. And then to visit uh, Tokyo, because everybody watch anime like uh, uh, Tenkinoko or uh, Kimi no Namae, where they, they like show, shoot some parts. Uh, I mean, they show some real parts of Tokyo, or some part of the cities in Japan. So they want to go there where exactly the uh, producer took uh, the idea of that spot. So they're curious about that or manga, anime, everything connected. Do you have any advice for other foreigners working in Japan who are also doing similar work? So like if I was a tour guide and I had no work, would you have any suggestions for me? 
Uh, so this is a tough question, in my opinion, because uh, I mean, there's a lot of tourist guide who speak English, so the competition is very high. I think uh, one of your, in your case, the, your like uh, good point is that your ability, your skill of Japanese is very high, and of course your mother language is English. So I think you can like play. You can take advantage of this. You can, you talk like a Japanese. So, and you know Hiroshima very well. So I think you can apply to be like a tourist guide for foreigner here in Hiroshima, I think. And if you have the chance to visit the mainly spots in other cities like Tokyo and Kyoto, and like, uh, mm, you don't need to, know everything about each temple. You just do like a uh, catch, catch the mainly part of the stories of the temple and like tell as a novel to the customer to make them wow, so good. to make them feel uh, uh, glad that they come to that place. And then like they let them free to visit the place without any rush. So my suggestion is like, uh, uh, study of course the story of this place but also take advantage of uh, your Japanese speaking. Is there a place where tour guides can talk or consult with each other or do you have an online community or an uh, office somewhere in Hiroshima or somewhere that you can go get help from? Uh, I don't know. My, my wife is as well as a tour guide so she can speak Japanese, of course, because she's Japanese. Uh, she can speak English and also Italian, so she can work for, with two different kind of customers, so English speaker customers, but also Italian customers. And she's inside a group of tourist guide, Japanese tourist guide in uh, Hiroshima. So sometimes they have like line where they share information about Hiroshima or about like the government uh, advi advice, ad 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 advice, really. advice, yes. Uh, but personally, I don't have any place where I can share here in Hiroshima with other guys because also I'm not a licensed guide, so I'm not allowed maybe to get into some information. But with some other Italian who are doing the same job but in the different cities, sometimes we share some information about uh, okay, this could be a good place where to bring customers. This must be a good place where to bring customers to eat some good food, sushi. I hear you have a YouTube channel. You mentioned it earlier. What's your channel's name and what do you like to talk about on your channel? Okay. Uh, my YouTube channel name is Polentone in Giappone. Buongiorno a tutti da Polentone in Giappone. Polentone in Giappone. Polentone in Giappone. Everybody asks me what does it mean. So Polentone is called someone coming from the north part of Italy because the north part of Italy in the past they made a lot of polenta, which, are, which was like okonomiyaki for Hiroshima, like a soul food, very cheap food made by uh, flour of, uh, uh, flour, I don't, really don't remember <laughs> from which kind of flour, but was made by flour, maybe I will tell you later. Uh, so, polenta and polentone, so polentone is one, uh, someone from the north part of Italy. In Japan, it means in Japan because I'm, North Italian guy came in Japan. Even now, I live in the south part of Japan. And what, uh, yeah, what my, do you do on your channel? My channel is, of course, pushing and promote Japan, but most of all Hiroshima because I say it's a underrated cities. So I I really like this city. So I really want to give something back to this city. And uh, so I like to show some hidden spots like you're doing on your channel as well. Uh, show the food, the soul food of Hiroshima. And uh, ah, now that I, I bought a drone, uh, I like to show Hiroshima or what else except Hiroshima from another point of view. Do you teach Italian? Because I may have to start learning it after talking to you about Italy so much. <laughs> Maybe I want to meet some Italians. Just they had uh, my first Italian lesson. 
in a language school. Uh, yeah, I mean, I've made some substitution of a teacher who were able to come. And uh, sometimes I teach English, but I, maybe it's not probably talking about like teaching English, but like a, a, a conversation in English to help some kids to grow up with vocabulary and also pronunciation. So I'm trying to do this kind of stuff. That's good. Uh, how would I say uh, work life Japan in Italian? Eh, lavoro vita Giappone. Lavoro vita Giappone. Iscrivetevi. 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 Ai canale. Ai canale. Sì. Lavoro vita Giappone. Hey! All right. Dario. Dario. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for joining us. And uh, yeah, we wish you the best of luck. We hope that uh, things get back more to normal for you. And uh, we're going to be watching your channel and rooting you on. Yeah. Thanks for joining us today. Thank you. Ciao. Ciao. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure to check out Dario's channel. All of his info is in the description below. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And as always, if you're looking for a place to live in the Hiroshima or Okayama area, feel free to contact us. We would love to help you out. <laughs>